Uh, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another Binding of Isaac Repentance. Uh, we're gonna win this time. We're getting serious. This is a dang serious occasion. Because we just keep taking really, really embarrassing L's. Uh, not serious enough to warrant using... Azazel. Uh, let's go with Kane. We could use ourselves a luck foot. Uh, the last two episodes, we've taken fat L's in trying to get just a singular additional cathedral dub. And they've been pretty promising runs. Uh, I can only say that... Well, okay. Let me rephrase. When I died, they were promising runs. The last one really was not promising until uh, probably the last 10 or so minutes. Um, the one before that was just all right, and we kind of goofed it. Which, uh, we goofed it by taking, uh, Curse of the Tower. I mean, that's like a lot of the goofs in this series, is from taking Curse of the Tower. And, uh, I'll, I'll be real with you. I probably will still keep taking it, despite the fact that it gets me killed very frequently. Uh, and the reasoning be behind that is that, like... It is good damage. If you think about it, the damage is solid. I do just also get hit. Uh, this room sucks. I'm of the per- uh, I stopped because I was planning on perishing. Um, of the personal opinion that this room's bad. Do not like this room. It just takes a long time and uh, I might die on it. On the bright side, though, oh, we do have a half heart waiting for us right here. And a great item waiting for us right here. Look at that. Stigmata is actually a sick item. HP up plus damage, two things that we are uh, in a desperate need of. Uh, petrified poop or the lockpick. You know, we haven't been getting a lot of chests as of recent, so honestly, we'll, we'll stick with the petrified poop for now. It might pay off more in the long run. Um, but yeah, after we do that, then we move on to the, uh, the Sheol floors. We got to get like two or three more dubs on Sheol, which shouldn't be too hard. I can't imagine that'll be too difficult. But I am saying that despite the fact that we've been taking fat L's on these cathedral runs. And without these cathedral runs, we can't even like begin to start to try to do any of the tainted runs or any of that fun stuff. Pretty fly. Cool. We like pretty fly. Um, let's not just take another two damage here. Uh, starting to now realize just how bad Kane's range is. I always knew that he had really bad range, but like, this is advanced level bad range. Also, this is kind of a tough, tough boss to get floor one. That's all right. I'm confident in our abilities to finish him off. There was never once even a single doubt in my mind that we would, uh, leave that with a dub. Alright, let's go to the next floor. Where we trip, stumble onto a piece of red poop and explode. Uh, I can't go in there. I hate to say it. So, it'd be cool to get some range. Like, a range up would be pretty sick. Odds are, though, since we're playing Kane and since we actually want to range up, that's probably not in the cards. But we can we can hope. Mom's lipstick, mom's heels, basically most of the mom items. We'd take almost all of them. Even mom's coin purse in this scenario would be pretty sick because we've got good pills. 
and then that's probably going to be the easiest way for us to get range ups. I'd say that's the most common source of range ups in my plays from range up bills. But normally it's tears down. I feel like it's, uh, whoo, dude, petrified poop is putting in work. I would like every other pill for most of the characters I play that aren't Kane. It's like, oh, yeah, we gave you a, a balls of steel, so to even it out, here's like three tears downs. You got yourself a health down. And, uh, you know, explosive diarrhea just because it's funny. Just because we think it's funny and, uh, you know, you looked like you needed it. One bomb for three bombs? Can't really be too upset. Ooh, that was, uh, that was, that was, well, it was scary, and it now is scary. This is kind of a sucky room. Then again, that's just I don't think I've seen this room before. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a good, uh, this is probably gonna come out on a Saturday. I hope you guys are having a good Saturday. I know I probably am. Odds are that, uh, I'm in the midst of... Man, petrified poop's good, but like that's a three range up. It's kind of what we need. Uh, probably in the midst of recording Shatter Days right now. Who knows? Hopefully, there's like a, a couple of actual options for Shatter Days. It's it's really tough for some of these weeks because you go to the store. You know, I've had this discussion before. You go to the store, you look for a game to play that might be interesting to watch. And it's like, okay, you got two things. You got literal money laundering shovelware. And then you got, you know, just like... Just hentai games. 100,000 different bedazzled, bejeweled, match three, turbo hentai games. And it's like, it's everywhere. That's basically all you can find for the most part when it comes to new games. There's some good ones. You know, uh, Cult of the Lamb came out not too long ago, and we've been playing the heck out of that, but... It's hard to find, like, decent or even, like, comically bad games to review for Shattered Days. Because a lot of the ones that would be considered potentially comically bad end up, uh, hey, we talked about Miter last run, end up, like, behind 20-something dollar paywalls, and I just don't have the kind of capital to be paying $20 for a joke. Also, gotta love the curse room that is just a fire and two enemies. Really is one of my favorites. Uh, maybe a secret room here? Let's go. Three pennies? Also, let's go. Two spiders. Slightly less go. Oh, sweet. The cool room. Um, excuse me, sir. That's unnecessary. But yeah, no, I gotta, gotta get my footing back for Isaac. We've been playing like garbage. Kind of, uh, I mean, you know, this run is no uh, exception. We've been making some silly mistakes, but that's okay. Because it's all in the name of a of, of a fat dub. I don't really want Baby Plum's flute that much. I mean, I don't have a space bar item. Don't get me wrong. But I'm hoping for one that's better than Baby Plum's flute. Okay, this... We gotta stop shooting him while he's doing that attack. That's when we get hit. He just starts going crazy. Uh, deal with the devil after getting an HP up. We gotta stop exclusively relying on... Deal with the angels. Because we keep holding out for a deal. And then we take damage and then we just... Eat it big time. We don't produce flies. We don't want that. Uh, next floor it is. 
But Jones, you could have gone back and used three uh, cents to reroll the items in the shop. Yeah, you know what? I could have. I do not want to, though. Okay, get this guy out, and then we can leisurely complete this room to our heart's extent. Also, super secret rock. That really... That really boils me up inside. Oh, man, you're just disrespecting me now. I would have much rather had, like, two to three spirit hearts instead of a single golden chest that gave me umbilical cord. I mean, umbilical cord's okay, but I pay two bombs and a key for it? Uh, absolutely not. Under very few circumstances would that be something that happened. And thank God for tapeworm. I'm like, that would have been really annoying. Oh, cool. I love that you can't bomb your way out of the like uh the mini boss sin fights i think that's awesome because they are all worthless very rarely do they give you anything worthwhile aside from a uh, a new respect for the time that you could have spent doing the rest of the floor but you know i get it like it's a challenge so it's uh a little bit of a challenge to fight them. Hey! Oh, almost got out of there without taking any damage. <sighs> so guys, I've been looking into it. I, I've been looking at the reach. I've been looking at the engagement. I've been taking a peek at those analytics. And I've caught you. About 78% of you, I've caught you. Caught you red-handed hand in the cookie jar. I know where you've come from. I see where I'm getting recommendations to. I can see where you come from. There's no hiding it. And I know a lot of you are uh, strolling on over here from Sinvicta. A significantly better Isaac player. I mean... I think he's on like a 200 win streak right now. Something like that. I can see forever. Unconceivable. Inconceivable? Non-conceivable? Couldn't imagine hitting 200 wins in a row. That's crazy. That is insane. I can't imagine it until now, of course, because uh, this right here, this is the start of our 200 win streak, this run right here. Every great journey starts with one single step, and uh, this is it. This is the one. Ouch. It's gonna happen. I'm feeling it. All because we're about to get a sick, nasty item from the item room. It's so good that I'm gonna need a drum roll for it. Mysterious liquid. I mean, it's okay. I mean, it's it's not by no means. It's is it a sick, nasty item? But it's it's an item. Oh no. No, it's okay. We we managed to. Oh no, we didn't. There's a sneeze coming on. Oh, we've recovered. I can see forever. We'll take that to the next floor. Bomb guy. Uh. Whatever, dude. We don't really care too much about bomb guy. I mean, we can go in for like a... Go to the curse room for a half heart. We've gotten our items. We haven't gone to the shop yet. And we are slowly but surely going to be running out of time to go to the shop. So, with the addition of... All of this money we just picked up, I suppose... We will actually go to the shop. As much as I really don't want to go through that big room. Ooh. I'm drowsy. Oh man, that would have been really... I, You know, you never... You find one I'm drowsy pill per game. You use it 
on like an empty room and you're like, you know what? I can't wait until I get that again. And then I'm going to use it on one of these bosses. And it just doesn't exist anymore. I feel like you take an I'm Drowsy pill and it just takes it right out of the pool after you take it. That's a... Uh, Lost Cork is an interesting question. Or it poses an interesting question. Uh, with Mysterious Liquid, do we want Lost Cork? Well, at the cost of three range, probably not. And due to the fact that most of the bosses are going to be flying anyway... Uh, maybe not. That's a incredible luck booster pack. The two of clubs will double our bombs. The moon, the devil, the magician, ancestral recall. Ancient Got three more recall. Ancient recall. Sorry, not ancestral recall. Wheel Wrong game. Fortune. Um, I don't think it's card two. The chariot. We're just curious about it. Do we know what this pill does? We do now, baby. Yes, a tears up. Can't complain about that. So let's let's check like how much greater does the I mean that is that is a lot greater. You know what? Sure. Cork is the uh the, the more epic more epic and cool option that is the fallen. I have now immediately regretted my decisions. Of course, uh, we can never get a non-flying boss, except for the one time that we did, and it was on the first floor, and it was three gurg gurgle gurgle mimers. Ouch. Okay, you're. Oh, you almost got me. You almost hit me with the the prank. Dark matter. That is sick. That is a sick thing to get. Um, still not a range up though. And we're gonna stick with the cork just because uh, we've made our bed, and now we're going to suffer in it. What is up, poop guys? I mean, the cork is like it's a it's a noticeable difference in creep. That's sick. A very noticeable difference, and if only we could get some range, I think we'd be pretty set for most enemy sakes at least. Oh, cool sloth. Kind of what I was asking for. So I get another mini boss. The fool. That's a cool chest right there. Can't really be too upset. All right, come on. You're you're done for. Um, things are going pretty solid. We're just we we know that we're gonna get hit in that room, so we're just gonna go ahead and do that. So, uh, you guys excited for uh, the rest of your Saturday? I know I certainly am. I've got big plans for Saturday. And by big plans, I mean the same plans as usual. But, uh, aside from those same plans as usual, I'm pretty interested to see what we're looking like. Because... Two days. It was two days. I think it was uh, yesterday and the day before that. In those two days, we went from 16 to 18 subs. And uh, not only am I a big fan of that, but we're so close to 20, baby, I can feel it. And then there's a, a big long-term project that I want to start when I hit 20. Which, uh, you know... Demographically speaking, I'm not sure how many of you will be interested in said project, but I think it's cool, and it's like a it's a, it's, it's like a passion project. But I mean, yeah, I think it'll I think it'll be cool. I hope it'll be cool. I hope people like it. But I'm waiting for that arbitrary 20 subscribers 
to unleash the beast. And I only say arbitrary because to everyone watching, it probably, you know, the, the number of 20 subscribers probably does not mean a whole lot. That's a that's a big number for me. Okay, we'll just we'll we'll take a take one on the chin and try to get the rest of these goobers out of here. But dude, 20? That's such a look at that. Um, that's such a such a big number. I still remember it. Remember it just uh just like I was a wee lad when I started this bad boy. Some a couple odd months ago. Dude, that creep damage does a lot. Surprisingly large number of damage ticks per second. Uh, range. Let's go. Oh, Krampus. Let's go. I walked into that because I was too focused on the fires. You know, Krampus, I, I actually like your head. Both in the sense that I'm going to kill you, but also in the sense that um, I don't really know if I want... I mean, I'll take coal. Don't get me wrong. I will take a lump of coal because the only other... What did... Did you get stuck in the wall there? The only other alternative is dying. Oh! Oh, you walked into me. Coward. You should never be allowed to attack that much. All right, we'll, we'll take a lump of coal. I would have been happy with Krampus's head. It's not often that I would say that I'm happy with Krampus's head. Oh, I forgot that I brought up a, a sweet Mountain Dew Baja Blast Zero Sugar. That's good stuff. No map. Good. Uh, good to see. I hate the map. It's always clogging up the screen with useless information like where I've been and where I'm going. Stuff really irritates me. Speak of the devil. Look, I'm telling you guys Uh-oh. I'm telling you guys the number one tip to success is to just complain. Every time I'm playing Isaac and I start complaining I just I get things that I uh, get things that I complain about not having. You might be saying, Jones, you complain a lot. Uh, first off, shut up. Second off, when I do complain, it typically works out to my benefit. So if I have the options of... Oh, man, that I hate that room. If I have the options of being um, either A, a loser, or B, a sore winner against a, a, a single player game I'll uh I'll, I'll take my my first place trophy thank you very much does I'm drowsy I'm honestly tempted to use that I'm drowsy pill just so I can get past that spike room I hate that room we've lost 24.8 percent of a chance to go to the deal with the devil that is so sad. Give me this key. A lot of Larrys. This is the Larry floor. The Larry layer. Depths 1, a.k.a. Larry's Domain. He's just chilling down here. You know, honestly... I'm gonna call this colon one. I mean, think about it. It's the depths. It's filled with... Larry Jr. and Pooh enemies. It's it's this the colon. We're we're in colon one right now. It's a sick card. I mean it's an alright card. Would I say it's better than I'm drowsy? Um no. No, I wouldn't. Uh greed. Oh what I meant to say was a gosh darn buddy in a box. Oh. Flat penny. That'd be kind of cool. What is this? Uh, is this is we got a Bucciarati baby? I don't know who it's supposed to be. Kind of looks like Bucciarati though. Oh, and he shoots crazy shots. 
Man's hitting the, the loop-de-loop -loop shot from Fester's Quest. You guys like Fester's Quest? I'm, I'm a I'm a pretty pretty big Fester's Quest fan. There it is. More reskin Larry's. Oh, he's golden! He turns people into money. I should have gone and picked up that darn sh shiny penny. What a baby. What a what a good buddy in a box. Without a doubt, simply just one of the greatest buddies in the box. I actually don't know. I don't know all the buddies in the box. It's not an item that I pick up very frequently. Um where's the item room? I know you guys have been paying attention. It must be this way. This must be where the item room is. On the other side of all these stinky enemies. Ouch. Oh boy, we got some uh, adrenaline damage, baby. Let's go. That is rocket in a jar. That is balls of steel. You know, honestly, I'll be real with you. Not really the biggest rocket in a jar fan. I am a big fan of that, though. But I trade two keys for a spirit heart. Uh, probably. Sorry, I heard a, a buzzing in the room and I had to address it. Now we got a lot of bombs, though. I mean, we could honestly start using some bombs defensively. I would say that might be, well, not defensively, offensively. If we use them defensively, we'll just uh, become obliterated. Wait a second here. Man, I took a damage thanks to a phone call. We love that. What if this was a secret room? Eh, it's worth a shot. Actually, no, we already checked there. It wasn't worth a shot. I lied. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Oh man, you guys stay over there. Oh, his fear came up the very second that he charged. That's a scam. I've been scammed. That's another HP up and a tears up and a shot speed down. Honestly, that's that's fine by me. Uh, we're on to the next floor. No issues. Feeling pretty good. I'm feeling good enough to come in here, give this man all my health, and get some fat adrenaline damage bonus. But Jones, isn't that normally how you die? Is by uh, giving something all of your health and then dying? Yes. So? It won't happen this time. I'm a firm believer in coincidence. And I believe that it's a mere coincidence that every time I give something all of my health, I end up perishing. Come on. Okay, I mean, that's a... That's sick, I guess. But not really what we're looking for. Oh, that's cool, though. Um, we got a bunch of damage, though. We're like, we're, we're balling heavily on our damage stat now. The only downside is that we cannot really get hit that much. But uh, as I always say, and I always mean it when I say it, we just won't get hit. Now understand me, there's a, a big difference in what I mean and what I can back up. In Isaac, at least. Isaac's just one of those games. It's one of those games that wants to make you, you know, turn out to be a liar. Uh, 
Yeah. Yeah, that's what we were, we were talking about that. Oh, come on, man. Skulls still representing their category as the just worst enemies. There is creep there. Not fair. I am exclusively holding the rights of creep. Hierophant is sick. The Hierophant. Listen, Hierophant, Hierophant. The two... The two blue hearts. Bard. The... Gosh darn, stuns a gun. Look at that. We just pressed spacebar and got a free key. Um, we're gonna come back here and hope that this guy gives us something awesome. Dude, that's so awesome. Oh, Lord of the Pit Demon Wings. I shouldn't have blown up that dang darn blood bank. I don't know what that does, but I'll be real with you. I'm really tired of not being able to see the map. I wish that I could just be one with seeing the map. We'll take a half hard to look at this. Oh, what a deal. Let's open this up first. Oh, what a deal. I basically traded one bomb for uh, two bombs and some stuff. So I think we're good. Like, I think we're solid for now. Once again, though I know I could find a way, I think it'll be pretty hard to mess this run up. We're doing pretty cool. I just have to not get hit. And I think that we can handle that. I really hope that we can handle that. Oh, hey, look, another buddy. All right, what are you going to give me? I'm feeling it. He's going to give me... Uh... Breakfast. All right, what we got here? That's a tears up. We'll save that just in case we end up goofing and gaffing. And pills and ate them. Um, so here's, here's the question. Do we take a tears up with us on the chance that we get a tears down in the future? Or do we take an I'm drowsy on the chance that we get in to one of the bosses that's very bullet spammy. I completely forgot about item rooms. I, if I would have gone to the boss, I would have just left. And I really hope that I don't uh, make a habit of that because that would have been the second time that I skipped out on an item room. Somebody get this goddamn jar of tears out of my item pool. This instant. I'm only going to take it to hopefully appease RN Jesus and get him to stop giving me this item. Isaac's Jar of Tears is without a doubt my least favorite recurring character in the Isaac saga. I hate this guy. He's my, my nemesis. Give somebody else a chance to shine. You, you glutton, you greedy, stinky, uh, uh, cylindrical glass head. You're lucky that I like the sound of you charging back up. Ouch. Um, now it's gonna be greed, right? No, BFF. I mean, we, we take BFF. We always take BFF. Our buddy's so much bigger now. Uh, we'll just throw the rest of this money into the donation machine. We gotta get that up to a big number at some point, right? 
I forget what all can be unlocked from the donation machine. I feel like... It, who Who is it? Do you unlock the... The one guy? You guys know what I'm talking about. Do you unlock the one guy from that machine, or is it from the greed mode machine? Hey, you know, honestly, I don't want to mess with you guys right now. I just want to see what this card is. Justice. With a spirit heart. Kind of sick. I need to start unlocking more characters. But the first step to unlocking more characters... Bad guess. First step to unlocking more characters comes at the hands of getting a couple of dubs. It's just merely that simple. Isaac. Isaac. You know, honestly, I think one of the biggest issues is that when I get to mom or something, I just have such bad stats normally that it takes so long that I start to get, like, bored of the fight. And then I just start making mistakes. Um... I mean, this is the absolute take, even at the cost of a little bit of our damage. Rotten Baby is absolutely sick. He's the sickest. What if... Now, hear me out. What if... He did it in two pulls? Okay, well... I thought it was worth a shot. All right. On to the next floor. I'm thinking that it's going to be to the right. I got a good feeling about this. I now have a horrible feeling about this after walking into a room and taking two damage. Uh, tonsil. Mm, nah. Dude, why are the shots from Isaac's Jar of Tears so slow? You telling me that Isaac's arm is weaker than his tear ducts? This man's over here shooting tears out of his eyes at a thousand miles per second. But he rears up the best, mightiest throw that he can do, and that shit comes lobbing around the corner. Like a, like a plastic bag slowly falling down the stairs with the AC on. Unreal. Okay. No, we, we don't we don't need any of this. Womb enemies. We all know. Womb enemies are the worst. Well, I mean shoal enemies kinda suck too. But womb enemies are pretty bad. We're uh we're hemorrhaging health right now. But that's okay. We're gonna go pick up some health. Oh man, we really do gotta go through a big room, huh? Honestly, yeah, check this out. I'm gonna take a gamble that this is where we need to go. And I hope that my gamble was correct. Dude, pills? I can see forever? I mean, let's take I can see forever, right? We don't know what this is. Health up. That's kind of cool. Lemon party. That is a huge lemon party. That's like a full room lemon party. Why? Why is that a full room lemon party? I wonder. Uh, we took the wrong room. But what if this was a segue to the other room? No, we took an I can see forever. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, we're getting out of here. We don't. We don't like you. We'll see what's in the secret room. It might be cool. Oh, why did I use a bomb? Once again, would like to point out. Slowly but surely losing it. Um, that is a tears up. That's cool. We like that. Uh, 14 cents. I'm feeling like you would like to give me something cool for 14 cents. That's sick, honestly. An extra hit. Cannot complain. Two bombs. Also cannot complain. Key. Uh, not, I would complain. Another key. Might complain. Might do a little bit of complaining. 
My goodness, he's green. So we're gonna give you. We can't even. We can't give him a half heart, can we? I think we'll just take our. He'll take our spirit heart if we do. Another golden key, huh? Oh. Now this is epic. Dude, go ahead. Eat up, man. I know you're hungry. Okay, I mean, I hope you're not much hungrier than that. Because I, you know, I can't really give you too much. But, you know, oh, very cool. I accidentally used the pills instead of the <laughs> bra. That feels bad. Where's my, I'm drowsy. It's way down there. Hmm. I mean, we'll take mom's bottle of pills instead. Just because. I'm not too upset. It would have just been nice to have a, you know, worst case scenario healing item. I figure we'll just blow this guy up then, yeah? Get back out. I'm drowsy pill. Dude, talk about return on investment. Except for that, uh, you know, we basically doubled it. I didn't even need to go back through that stinky room to get my I'm Drowsy pill. This feels bad. Oh my goodness. Our homie's shooting bones. Man's got the bone shot. Hey, stay away. So we got the Chad Bone Baby with us this floor. I didn't even look to see what we had for last floor. Um, like, we'll do it twice just so we can get back to uh, Four of Babylon. Oh, spike rocks. I thought they were spike pits. Don't you love that they had to get away that... Oh, you've got flying? Well, we gotta hit you with spikes one way or another. I'm such a big fan of everything spike-related in this game. It's just so awesome and cool. Speed up. We'll take that. Now we're at uh, the same speed. Almost got hit there. But, uh... That's merely to appease the enemy. Now that he's dead, I'll point out that I would have never gotten hit there. Kind of a cool room. Basically, free donation progress. We're gonna hit like 420 something, maybe. A red candle. That's cool. Uh, did we actually? It kind of looked like we went out on 420, but I think it was 421. Uh, it, it, all right, guys. Red candle versus blue candle. I uh, don't remember the difference, if I'm going to be real. I think one stays around longer, but one does more damage. And I think it's Blue Candle that does more damage. But uh, once again, I cannot remember for the life of me. Uh, I should really stop going so close to those guys. I actually don't benefit very much from just running up on them actually quite dangerous. Ooh, is that another... Ah, oh, it's a power pill. There's our uh, worst case scenario pills back. Brown cap? That's a... Uh, when you shoot poop, it explodes. Pretty sure. Pretty funny. It's like a... Kind of a, a funny pill, I suppose. That's another power pill. I should probably wait to use these. But I guess we can go grab this power pill after the boss now. Well, actually, huh. is this womb one? I can't remember. Utero two? Yeah, no, we can't go grab that. That's okay. That's all right. We didn't need to go grab it because we're not going to have to use our power pill because uh, we're not going to get hit. Simple as. Okay, cool. I like that. The lovers. 
I mean, if we need it. All right. It, it lives. Time to get back at you for what happened to me last game. Easy. Quite possibly one of the easiest fights ever. Um, useless. I'll die. I think we'll take this one. Yeah, we got Leviathan. Let's uh, let's run up in this bad boy and just what if? What if uh, what if blood bag in two uses? I mean, it, it didn't happen, but it was entirely possible. All right, time to go claim our cathedral dub. Um, I'm feeling straight up. By God, we're rocking Tetris, baby. Never thought I'd see the day. Dude, we're getting power pills like crazy. All right, Tetris. What is Tetris baby shooting? Like, mucus? We got a... Tetris the mucus baby. Kind of cool. Other than that, I have no idea what they're shooting. Maybe little slime balls. Okay, right, stop. Yep, there we go. Um, Envy. <laughs> Very cool. Do we get anything from this? Not really. I knew it would be too much to ask. When did we get this extra heart? Not that it truly matters that much. Oh my god. You know, honestly, uh, the, the pot enemies, they make it into the top 10. Those, those guys suck. They just, I don't, I don't run into them frequently enough for them to make it into top 5. But, uh, pot ghosts... There, the easy top 10. Very easy top 10 with no contest. I'll have to do like an, an Isaac enemy tier list at some point. Let's talk about the absolute worst enemies. Uh, the fact that I did not get hit there is crazy. Also, we're not going in there. If I went into that curse room and then ended up losing by like one hit I'm sure somebody would throttle me because you know I'm all for fun and games but at some point you've got to win you know This is... Things have really fallen apart in this last room or so. Oh my god, as I live and breathe. Steam sale. Isaac's done for now. Isaac is toast. Yeah, we'll take that. That'll give us one more hit. temporarily give us one more hit, I should say. Now power pills not necessarily the uh, ace in the hole. I found pills. I mean, you know. Ouch. It's just a, uh, it's a damn the uh, boss debuff now. Is that Anarchist Cookbook? Would that summon the nukes? Yeah, we are we are, we gotta stop taking damage. Alright, Isaac, calm calm down. Calm down, big boy. If we walked into it. We shan't lose, Isaac. I've got too much riding on this. My reputation's already in in pieces. It's in shambles. I'll have to 
climb up to regain my uh, my title as a moderately okay Isaac Blair. All right, we we did it. Isaac's been clapped. The coin bag. We unlock pay to play. The Polaroid has appeared in the basement, baby. That's what it's all about. That is what we've been waiting for. Look at that. And then presumably two more negative runs and uh, we'll be golden. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that run of the Binding of Isaac Repentance. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe down below. And uh, I will see you guys later. Ciao.